Hello, ladies and gentlemen, we are back here on Pixelmon, and today, uh, today's the world download day. <laughs> I promised it episode 15, uh, so yeah, I'm gonna try and get that out. I don't know what's the best way to do it, so I'm gonna have to figure out how to do that after this episode. Uh, maybe I'll ask a few people that have given out world downloads, I'm sure, like, Grazer and Mitch have. So, yeah, I could just ask them, <laughs> they're smarter than me. Uh, but here's the issue, I haven't built anything, <laughs> well, I mean, I haven't made it look pretty. So basically, all you're gonna get from this world, unfortunately is gonna be the boss farm and the diamond farm which is what you guys basically wanted <laughs> you guys wanted to take a look at that uh, see just basically see how it works I guess is the right way to say it so let's go up here and take a look really quick uh, I'll show you guys all the design really quick I do have a cold I do have a cold so I may have to make a few cuts in this episode just so you don't hear me sniffling or, or sneezing or something like that <laughs> Schneezing. Uh I don't want any of that on my video I refuse. I won't let it happen. So let's go up here. Uh, so yeah, uh, I think I'm gonna do a tutorial soon enough about how to make it like properly. Like I obviously did most of it off camera, uh, which I'm sure a lot of you didn't want to see that. Uh, but I'll just end up posting up a video not on my single player world, but like on just in a creative world, uh, how to make this. So basically, what I did was cut down this entire. Oh, someone just died. Oh, no, probably world is just taking damage. Uh, cut down this entire jungle. Uh, make sure there's no leaves on the ground. <laughs> I think that's a Kanye West song, isn't it? Leaves. I feel like it is. Oh, no, it's blood on the leaves. That's it. Never mind, I lied. Uh, let's go ahead and get on my Charizard. Where's my Charizard? There he is. Uh, bump. Come up here. Now, we fly up here. I have the ladder there just in case you want to do it, but I suggest getting a flying type, whether that be Charizard or Pidgeotto or Pidgeot, I mean, or something like that. I don't know. You come up here, a legendary spawn in a plains biome. That's not a Mew. <laughs> uh, basically, I showed last episode. If you guys want to go watch something cool, uh, last episode I showed you how legendary or how spawning works when you're up this high. Uh, oh no, that was the wrong button. Did I show anything with that? Oh god, I thought I might have shown something really bad, like my IP or something. That scared me. <laughs> that could have been bad. Uh, oh, who's die? Who die? Golding die. Golding sucks. Uh, but yeah, basically, they're all spawning down there. Well, they're not now, because there's no leaves on the ground. Oh, oh, oh. So that either means there's a little bit of leaves on the ground, or a Mew spawned up here. Like, there might be some back there. Okay, they're spawning and despawning. Let's see. Is Mew spawning up here? Yeah, obviously I missed a few leaves. <laughs> nope, there he is. Found him. So, in a plans bound. There's a plans over there. There's nothing I could do about that one. <laughs> uh, but we did find a Mew, I guess. Let's try capturing him. <laughs> I mean, might as well. So, yeah, this is how it works. It's very simple. And now with that uh, new a legendary has spawned or whatever, it makes it really easy. Come here, Mew. I want you. I want you back. I want you back. Thunder wave. Dun, 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 dun. So yeah, that's gonna make it really, really. E Wait, I could use Thunderbolt on this guy. Oh no, I could use Swift. That's easy. Oh, that was a crit. Whatever. Swift. Wait, does he know rest? Oh no, he's paralyzed. Okay, that that explains it. <laughs> Why he didn't attack me. Ah, oh, sweet. Good job, Electabuzz. Uh, let's switch you out to Scyther. Can I catch him? You just like right off the bat like this? <laughs> That'd be so easy. There we go. All right, one HP. He's paralyzed. Let's see how many Ultra Balls this takes. But yeah, this makes it really easy if you guys want to mew. Uh, you can just, if you chop down every single leaf on the ground, I mean, whenever it says a legendary spawn in a jungle biome, the only place where it can spawn is here. <laughs> I mean, if it says a legendary spawn in a plains biome, that's obviously not the biome I'm in, so that's something else. I still don't know what Pokemon spawns in a plains biome. I, I have the hunch that it's either Rayquaza or Zapdos. I don't know which one. I feel like it's one or the other, though. I don't know exactly. Mew escaped. Oh, he's transform. This Mew has transform. I want this Mew. <laughs> yeah, I already have like five Mews, but you know, it doesn't hurt to have another one. I need coffee. Oh, I love this music. <laughs> Let me tell you something. Pixelmon has some of the best music you will ever hear in a game. Oh, God, he knows metronome? Oh. Ooh, do not use like takedown or explode or something or self destruct. Don't use any of that stuff. No, ain't nobody got time for that. Oh, by the way, I'm not going to be wasting a Master Ball on him. I may have tons of Master Balls, but I'm not wasting it on him, you. Especially if he's not enormous. I don't think this guy's enormous. I already have one anyways. Dun, 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 uh. I still need to capture an enormous pincer, and that might be one over there. Did I get him? 
Nope, you used pound. It's, that's not a good move, Mew. <laughs> it's kind of really random. Nope, there goes another legendary. <laughs> They're all spawning in the plains, found. <sighs> so I wonder if there was two that spawned up here, and maybe... No. I feel like they couldn't have despawned in time by the... Oh, count them. There we go. I feel like they couldn't have despawned by the time I got up here. Yeah. I, I doubt that anyways. I think there's some leaves on the ground over there. Maybe some back there or something like that that I just missed. Uh, not a big deal. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> I already have all my Mews. So let's go. Let's see this Mew. Where is he? There he is. He's ordinary. Not bad. Let's throw him in my legendary box. There he is. Yeah, we already have five. Uh, keep this organized. This is my good one. Yeah, that's my good one. Uh, there we go. Perfect. Hey, look, a boss oddish. <laughs> it's working. <laughs> it still works. Uh, let's just send out Charizard. Now, uh, let's actually get Elekid some levels. There we go. My Elekid. Uh, you're not going to be able to fight him. <laughs> I'm going to send out Scyther. So you could just air slash him. Or X scissor. We'll use X scissor. Even though it is neutral. Because he is. Half grass and half poison. Oh god, I'm paralyzed. How'd you get paralyzed? Oh god, Scyther, are you gonna die to an Oddish? That's right, you're not. <laughs> there you go, I like to gain a bunch of those. Ooh, light screen. That's not bad. Let's get rid of Swift. What do we get? We got Nest Ball, Dusk Ball, and Dive Ball. Alright, three, three, three balls. <laughs> I have three balls now. Uh, let's heal up, and then we'll go searching for another... I want to find that legendary Pokemon that spawns in planes. I do. I just want to find him. <laughs> I want to see who it is. I want to know what it is. I want to find him. I need more coffee, very badly. I feel like I should also take out my tre or my Vibrava. Oh, what did I do with him? Is he in here? I had a Vibrava last episode, and I don't remember what I did with him. Did I lose him? Did I accidentally throw him out or something? I feel like that's a huge possibility of me doing. Or was I trading Quilava? I swear I had had a Vibrava somewhere. I just don't remember for the life of me what I did with him. He shouldn't be in here. No. He should be in here. But I don't see him. <laughs> ah, oh well. Uh, let's, let's train up Drift. Wait, are you enormous or are you just giant? You're just giant. I don't want you. You suck. I want... Well, actually, I'll hold on to you. Just in case I see another Drifloon. If you guys could shut up, that'd be great. Uh, let's train up Magnemite. Wait, are you enormous? No, oh, you're giant. Crap! Why is everyone giant? Be enormous. You're enormous, right? Yeah, you are. Okay, we'll get a Typhlosion. There we go. <laughs> you are one big-ass gloom. Holy crap. <sighs> let's see how many diamonds we have in here. 57. We have 57 diamonds from the diamond farm. Uh, obviously, I could make that a lot more efficient. <laughs> if you guys want to make a diamond farm, I suggest finding the better river than the one that I found. I just kind of did it because it was right there. Jumping down. Jumping down. Let's get Charizard out. Bump. Get that off my hotbar. Alright, let's go look through our plans again. You know, maybe we could find an enormous Drifloon because I'd like to get an enormous Drifloon. Drifloon's a pretty badass Pokemon. That's all I'm going to say. He is pretty badass. Uh, I just healed, so I think we're good. Uh, let's go ahead and look around. Let's see if we could get one of the uh, a legendary spawn in a plains biome because that's what I want. Oh, refrigerator's on. Hi, refrigerator. Uh, that is a flappy. I don't need a flappy. I don't want a flappy. I don't need it. <clears throat> All right, I'm about to sneeze. <laughs> I, I am about to sneeze. I'm like hiding the bag. I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> that was the wrong noise, but yeah, I'm I'm hiding that back. Wait, let's see if this is an enormous drip loan, drift loan. Oh god, <laughs> I'm trying my best not to. Nope, mine's bigger. Suck it, drift loan. Hold on. <clears throat> All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm back. <laughs> I, I told you I'm gonna have to keep doing that. Basically, I walk home from school every day, or I I walk from my school to the train station. What is it? Oh, that was a melting. I thought that was like a black venom gnat. I walk from my school to the train station, which is like two blocks, not a big deal at all. Uh, but I take the train station home. Is this my base? Oh, that is a big Drifloon. That is a big Drifloon. That has to be enormous, right? Uh, but I take the train station home. That's like a 30-minute train. That has to be enormous. Uh, and then I walk two miles from that train station that I get off at home. And it's freezing outside. It sucks. Okay, he has to be enormous, right? 
Yeah, he is. He is enormous. I declare you enormous, and I am about to capture you. Come here. Come here. I like to buzz it. Your job is to thunder wave him. Good job. So proud of you. And now set up a light screen so I can bring in my drift loon safely. And he should not be able to harm him. Oh, wait, I'm four levels above him. Never mind. You're fine, drift loon. Um, use gust. There you go. I'll hit him one more time. Yeah, I don't want to accidentally crit him. Let's just leave it at that. Alright, uh... Nest ball. <laughs> Crappy Pokeballs that I never want to use again. Just get out of my inventory. In case I actually find a good boss that'll give me some good stuff. Unlike you. Freaking Oddish. <laughs> uh, oh, he didn't He didn't even like shake once. Alright. Uh, then we'll just use an Ultra Ball. Like he, okay, yeah. He has to be enormous. He's either giant or enormous. I feel like he's enormous though. Oh, come on, get in the ball. I should have brought an XP share with me. I don't know if I have one on me. Oh, you jerk. Do I have an XP share on me? I don't know. I don't know if I could check in my bag if it's there or not. <sighs> comfortable. <laughs> a lot of times I sit in one space and I just cannot get comfortable. I'm one of those guys that just can't. <laughs> Yesterday I got a haircut. And the first thing that I was told by my mother was, My God, you have thin ass hair. I have, I've always had very thin hair. <laughs> Just my mom never noticed it and she like I got a hair. Yes. Thank you. Get out of here <laughs> I never want to use you again uh, Like I've always had thin hair. It's not like it's luscious or whatever. It's just pretty thin It's not like disgustingly thin, but it's, it's thin. <laughs> it looks like I'm going bald. This is an enormous cue bone It has to be uh, <laughs> Yeah, but I was like expecting I get home, you know a nice haircut or something like that she just walks into the house after I pick her up. Like, I pick her up from the train station every day because, oh, yeah, I forgot that he's ground type. I pick her up from the train station every day. Uh, <laughs> so we're in the car. She doesn't notice it. I'm like, okay, it's dark, whatever. We get into the house. We're about to eat dinner. My God, you have thin ass hair. And I'm like, oh, thanks, Mom. I really appreciate that. <laughs> That's a real confidence booster. Thank you so much. Uh, can I capture you? Can I capture you? No problem. Scyther's just weird looking, isn't he? I feel like they need a new model for Scyther, even though I do like Scyther. He needs a new model. Alright, let's see. Cubone. Enormous. Yes, 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 yes. That's what I am talking about. That's two Pokemon down. Two Pokemon down. And one of the ghost... I think that's one of the two ghost types in this game. Or set of ghost types, like Ghastly, Gengar, and Haunter. Oh, hi, Graveler. <laughs> Air slash, kill him. Good job. Uh, <laughs> I feel like there's only two, so basically I got them both out of the way now. And I could fall swipe anything that comes in. <laughs> Makes it super easy. I still need to catch a Nummel. I meant to go into a Plains Biome, but I somehow wandered into a desert. Which I do need Pokemon from a desert also, but eh. I'd rather be in a Plains looking for that legendary Pokemon that I still don't know what it is. <laughs> Dig. Whenever I hear Diglett, I always think of from the anime. Uh, it was like one of the first episodes, I think. Not like one or two, but like maybe episode 10, somewhere around there. Uh, there was like the, the Diglets, and they're like all doing like mad work or whatever. They're doing like labor. And they're like, Diglett, dig, Diglett, dig. And then the dog trees would be like, trio, trio, trio. Diglett, dig, Diglett, dig. Trio, trio, trio. <laughs> and sometimes they do that. Oh, this is a big Diglett. There he is! I heard him! I heard him! Dig the dig, dig the dig. Please say that's you that made that noise. We're gonna capture this dude. We're gonna capture this dude. Oh, he's ground type 2. Crap! Uh, Scyther. Like, some of them make it, some of them don't. I wish they all made it. Uh, false swipe. See, I predicted the ground type moves, so I brought in my flying type Pokemon. <laughs> ah, that's another thing that you guys have been asking me about. Uh, basically, my Pokemon channel. It is, it's made. <laughs> I'm gonna do it sooner or later. Uh,. Basically, I just want the artwork done for that channel, and I'm just going to wait for that. Like, I have someone making it. I have someone making my uh, my main channel right now. Uh, I'm patient about it. She's a super good girl, her, or super nice girl, let me rephrase. Enormous, yes! Her name is Starpling. Uh, she has a deviant art. She is very, very good. I follow her on Twitter. Uh, she's probably one of my most recent ones that I followed. Uh, if you want to go check her out, I suggest it. It's like Starpling or Strapling. I always get it mixed up. Uh, but yeah, she's really nice. She's helping me out a lot. 
Uh, she's made some cool art. Uh, I think she has sneak peeks of my uh, new avatar coming up there on my channel if you guys want to go check that out. Uh, once she is done with that, she said she will work on my Pokemon thing. I just need ideas for <laughs> what my Pokemon channel's avatar and banner will be. Uh, but that's that's going to be a little while from now. <laughs> uh, let's see. I, I don't know how I end up in a swamp now. <laughs> I just kind of got lost. We've caught three enormous Pokemon that I need. Wait, did I already have a Diglett? Did I already have a Diglett that I caught? I don't think I did. Okay, good. I didn't. <laughs> I had to think about that for a second. I'm like, I, I think I've caught one before. I don't remember if it was this season or not. I know in one of my uh, off-screen Pixelmons, I, I like playing Pixelmon off-screen, or I used to, <laughs> uh, before I started recording. Uh, I caught a Shiny Diglett, and Shiny Diglett was the crappiest Diglett I've ever seen in my life. He is just horrible. He looks exactly like a Diglett, but instead of having... What does he have now? A red nose? <laughs> Diglett, the red nose, reindeer, reindeer. Uh, instead of having, like, the nose that he has, I think it's red, uh, he has a blue one. Which is just like, okay. He's like a clown. <laughs> He's the clown Pokemon. I already have an enormous Kangaskhan, don't need him. I already have an enormous Voltorb. Uh, Mareep I don't care about. <laughs> yeah, I, I hate Mareep's noise. It sounds like a whining little baby. Mareep. Oh god, Mareep. Or like a, like an old woman. <laughs> I can't, I've fallen and can't get up. Mareep. <laughs> uh, uh, Mareep's, Miltank, Drifloon. I already have all you. Get out of here, you knuckleheads. I do need some Pokemon from Extreme. I need Pokemon from every single biome. I think I should just start off by saying that. I don't think there's one that I've completed. I think I'm very close to completing the swamp biome because there isn't too many in there. Alright, maybe I should take a look at these Doduos. I don't know. Neither of them are enormous. Not even close, really. Um, I do need a Lickitung. If that big one wins, kills the smaller one, I'll I'll try capturing him. Let's see. Who's winning? Who's winning? Oh, big, big Lickitung is winning. Go on, big Lickitung. That on my health bar. Come on! Just lick him to death. Oh god! Come on! <laughs> oh. <sighs> You're like sitting on him. Just lick him. Just, just go on, lick him. Oh my god! If you die, I swear I wasted my time on this. You are gonna die. You are gonna die. Is there a better lick a tongue? You're so close to killing them, yet you just can't. There you go. Oh, you're dead. Fantastic. <laughs> I'm not capturing that small-ass Lickitung. That's not happening. Oh. I thought that was a boss Fero. Why does Fero... Oh, okay. It's not shiny. Shiny Pokemon have like a little star there, so you could tell if he's shiny or not. That was just a normal Fero that looked strangely colored to me. But he was not, apparently. Dun, 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 dun. That's another thing. I've only seen one shiny in this... In this world, oh, Reno, <laughs> Reno 911. Uh, but I've only seen one shiny Pokemon in this game, and I did not get the chance to capture them. Uh, I'm sure a lot of you remember that from my episode eight or nine, Muse and Master Balls, uh, where I saw him. I saw that it was shiny, but he was in my. Oh, is that a War Turtle? Is that a War Turtle? No, it's a Nita. Damn it, Nita Arena. <laughs> I saw him in my boss farm. And I just was not able to get to him in time. Uh, let's jump on my Charizard really quick. Alright, Charizard, come on. Let's go looking. Let's go looking. Let's get past this. Is there anything back there? I've already caught most of the Pokemon in the uh, forest. I need, like, a Bulbasaur, a Turtwig, and enormous ones are those. I have both of them already. I just don't have the enormous ones. Uh, I need a Lunatone from here. <laughs> I need quite a few things. Uh, but let's get out of here. Let's go back into the plains. I want to find that legendary Pokemon. I need it. Oh, this is actually a pretty big Geodude. Hi, Geodude. Time to be caught. I need to capture these guys. I think I'm going to end up buying a new account uh, for just to have. I mean, <laughs> the name .hbomb, I think, needs to go away. <laughs> I think it's about time I just get something else. I mean, it doesn't have... I mean, it is the H-bomb. I'm sure a lot of people have gotten used to it. 
but I don't like, <laughs> I like, I go into, let's say I go on Mindplex and someone recognizes me. They say, H-Bomb, oh my god, I love your videos. And people are like, oh, you make videos, what's your channel? I don't like telling people what my channel is. I feel like that's so scummy. I, I just don't. I'd rather have the name just H-Bomb94, so if they wanted to see what my channel was, they just look up H-Bomb94 Minecraft <laughs> on YouTube or something, or Google, or I don't know. I just, oh, that's a big soul rock. Or Lunatone. That's a Lunatone, not a Soul Rock. Uh, but yeah, I just don't like that. <laughs> uh, let's go Lunatone. I just rather have H Bomb 94. Uh, that's basically it. Ooh, heal block. Let's use Air Slash. Don't kill him, don't kill him, don't kill him. Good job. Okay, that did more damage, but let's just keep full swiping so I don't accidentally kill him. Give me like a crit. I got another one HP, anyways. Confusion. Uh, Ultra Ball! <laughs> Hopefully this is an enormous one. Like, I've seen Lunatones, and that guy seems bigger than the average Lunatone. That's all I gotta say. He's bigger than the average Tone, you know? Uh, let's send out Electabuzz. Electabuzz! God, I love my Pokemon. <laughs> I've caught so many awesome new ones, and I'm very pleased. I don't think he's down to 1 HP, actually. <laughs> I don't think I got him. Yeah, I don't think I did. <laughs> did I even Thunder Wave him? Did I Thunder Wave him? I don't think I did. Okay, now he's paralyzed. <laughs> I'm an idiot. <laughs> Ultra Ball. I brought out Electabuzz just to throw out an Ultra Ball. I'm an idiot. Alright, come on. Get in the ball. I don't know how hard Lunatone is to capture. Like, what's his capture rate? Uh, but I feel like it should be average. So, this shouldn't take too long, right? Like, if this was Pokemon... <laughs> if this was Pokemon Ruby or Sapphire, he'd already be in the Ultra Ball. But this is Pixelmon, where it's extremely hard to capture Pokemon. I should just get the ball. Like in X and Y, I'm replaying X and Y right now. Uh, Nuzlocke. <laughs> I like doing Nuzlocke in case anyone's wondering. Uh, and I was about to say something. I had a reason for bringing that up, but I can't remember it. Oh, I gotta check to you, dude, too. Shh. Wow. Okay, I definitely need a new loot tone. tone. That, that one was horrible. Okay, yeah, I knew that was a big Geo, dude. Sweet. <laughs> uh, but I'm replaying Pokemon X and Y. And basically, I'm trying to think of a cool character for myself. Uh, like, I'm trying to give myself fancy clothes, trying to get my hair all the way I want to do it. <laughs> it's fun just playing that. Oh, and I know why I brought it up. Oh, there's a boss of Miltank up there. Uh, the reason why I brought it up was the last uh, Pokemon X and Y I played, uh, when I was capturing Mewtwo, <laughs> all I did was just throw Dusk Balls at him. And it took me like five Dusk Balls when he was at full health to capture him. That, that's why I wanted to bring it up. Mewtwo's always been a hassle to capture because he has that move Rest, and it's just so annoying. Rest or Recover, they've always been really annoying. I think he actually has Recover, not Rest. Um, X-Scissor. Kill this jerk of a mill tank. Oh god, you're low. Wait, did he just do all that damage to you, or were you low before this? Can use Growl? Air Slash, then. That's why we have this. <laughs> Air Slash is a special attacking move, even though Scyther doesn't have a lot of special attack. There's a lot of Pokemon, like this, for example, that are bosses and use moves like Growl. Ice Heal, Sandstorm, and Awakening. <laughs> Most Pokemon I can, like, one-hit KO with uh, X-Scissor because it's Stab, it's powerful. And not a lot of Pokemon resist Bug. Ooh, that's another thing I want to talk about. I found out, I think I found the reason why Psychic is weak to all of its weaknesses. And Psychic is supposed to resemble... I guess like a human kind of deal or something like that. And what are humans mostly afraid of? Well, they're afraid. Oh, there's a village right here. They are afraid of the dark. So dark type Pokemon. They're afraid of ghosts, ghost type Pokemon. And they're afraid of insects or bugs, bug type Pokemon. So there are three weaknesses <laughs> humans are all afraid of. <laughs> I found that very interesting. I read that on something. Mitch linked me uh, Pokemon conspiracies or something like that. And that was one of them. I was like, oh, okay. I never knew why <laughs> psychic Pokemon were weak to bugs, but that actually explains why. That's actually that's actually really cool. <laughs> I'm curious how many people actually knew that. 930. Ooh, what's over here? I haven't actually been out this far, I don't think. I think I should turn around now uh, because I feel like 1.7.2 will be coming out very soon to Pixelmon. So, yeah, let's just turn around. I don't want to explore new land. I just want to kind of explore <laughs> explore land that I've already found. Uh, so we did find a village, but eh, I already found like four. Let me out of here. 
Nope. Trampled your crops. Suck it, villagers. <laughs> Alright, so one last thing that I want to do is I want to get the coordinates to my base because I have no idea where spawn is in this world. I have no clue, like, where you spawn in on this world. So I want to go... Oh, God, that was a lot of grammars that just spawned. I want to go back to my base uh, where... Oh, I gained levels. I gained level 10. Sweet. Uh, <laughs> oh, Dragonair's in there. Hey, Dragonair. I'm gonna kill you. Dragonairs do not drop diamonds anymore. That's stupid to me. I don't know why Dratinis drop them, but Dragonairs don't. Wait, let's double check this. Right? Yeah, Dragonairs apparently don't drop them anymore. They used to. And now that, like, hinders my diamond farm a lot. Because there's there seems to be a ton more Dragonairs spawning than Dratinis. And I don't know why. <laughs> if Dragonairs drop diamonds still, I'd have so many more diamonds. I'd probably have, like, triple that. Like, probably a few stacks by now. Alright, so I gotta go find my way back to my base. And I don't even know the coordinates, but we'll be right back. And for you guys that want to come look at my boss farm, I'll give you the coordinates, obviously. Oh, hi, Ekans. How's it going? I'm going to air slash you. I'll give you the coordinates so you can see exactly what you're trying to find. <laughs> like I said, I don't even know where the hell I spawn. I don't know if like you spawn in this uh, world at zero, 0 or what. But yeah, let's see if I can find my way back. Am I going the wrong way? I am going the wrong way. I want to go like over here. Eh, let's jump out my Charizard. Alright, I'll be right back. Alright, I'm still lost looking for my place, but I found this boss sand slash. <laughs> This is the scariest thing I think I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> He's a red boss, and this just does not look fun at all. Uh, let's send out my Rayquaza. Um, no, I can't send out... Yeah, I have to send out my Rayquaza. I did actually not even put the experience share on my... <laughs> uh, Quilava, like I said I was going to. <laughs> I totally forgot about that. Alright, let's use Hyper Voice. How much will that do? Not much at all. Ah, and he critted me. Twister. Okay, I did about the same. Defense call. Crap. Hyper Voice. I think Hyper Voice is a special attack, so we'll just use that, I guess. Right, that's going to do nothing to my Rayquaza. Fury Cutter, get out of here. Defense Curl, get out of here. Use Hyper Voice. There you go. What did I get? Safari Ball, Overheat, uh, crap. Nest Ball, crap. Swagger, crap. Absolutely horrible stuff. <laughs> that was just dreadful. Let's see if that is actually the Extreme Hills that I go to. Because I know... I think that is. Is it? <laughs> it is. Okay, sweet. So that means that I want to go, give me a second, <laughs> I have to think, hold on, um, I want to go that way, right, I hope so, yeah it is, I'm pretty sure, <laughs> I'm smarter than the average bear, so we did find that and now we're good, hey Lunatone, I want to try seeing how big you are, but I'm not going to do that, I could do that off camera, Lunatones suck, Lunatones aren't one of those cool Pokemon that you want to show on camera capturing more than once, it's not like a Mudkip or something like that. Which I got really lucky with the Mudkip. He took me like an hour to find. And then when I did find him, he was enormous. So I got really, really lucky on that. Cause that was, oh god, who am I fighting? Drifloon. Air slash him! He's dead. Killed him. <laughs> uh, so yeah. Basically how to get from place to place around here. A My uh, Extreme Hills is directly that way. Straight east. Uh, my village should be right there. Right? Yeah, my village. Please load in for me. Please load in. Please load in for me, village. There you can see the top of it. Just go straight east. There will be a village right there. And then keep going east past that. Just keep going the same way. And there will be my plains biome that I chopped down a bunch of trees at. Uh, and my plains boss farm that doesn't work. Trio, trio, trio. Um, that barely works as it is because... The, the reason why... <laughs> I've, I've said this a few times. The reason why you make boss farms in jungles is because... The only po like there's no fire types in here, so no one can like resist damage from fire other than bosses. So that's those are the only ones you want to stay alive. You want to kill the rest because they suck. <laughs> you just don't want the rest. So yeah, guys, this is where it is. The coordinates are negative six hundred. Let's actually get this right. We'll get we'll get you to the Pokemon Center. It's gonna be like six hundred and fifty. Yeah, negative six hundred fifty and Y. Wait, Z is four forty. See if I was right on the money. Ten blocks. Ah, can I make it? No, it's gonna be four fifteen. Yeah, it is crap. So negative six thirty plus four thirty. That's how you get here. There's my nether portal. I've been through there once. <laughs> I, I gotta make like a huge for next se or 
not next season. Uh, for the next 15 episodes before it, I will be sure to build something. I just need inspiration, and I'm doing a lot of building on the cube, so <laughs> that's taking up a lot of my time uh, and a lot of my inspiration and me just not wanting to build when I come on here. Uh, yeah, I need some ideas. Maybe something Pokemon-themed. I don't know. Give me some ideas. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed. Get out of here, knuckleheads.